So, what's good, YouTube? What's up with you, man? It's your boy, Jobshot23. Back it again with another video. And first and first, make sure you guys hit that like button. Hit that sub button if you guys are new to the channel for more great content like this. And my viewers will come on the way. Now, guys, this is officially the Donovan Mitchell replica build for NBA 2K23. Now, guys, I will be quickly be showing you guys how you guys can make this build. And I must say, you guys will definitely be surprised, you know what I'm saying, about uh, how you guys can make uh, his replica build this and that. So, other than that, let's get straight into it. Now, guys, I know um, yeah, almost everyone you know who David Mitchell is. If y'all don't know who David Mitchell is, I'm going to give a quick recap. PP match play for Cleveland Cavaliers. Uh, he got drafted in 2017 with the um, 13th pick, I believe. And overall, like, you know, he... Uh, he used to pay for the jazz and yeah that's much i need to know but i want you guys to make as a shooting guard on um jersey number number 45 of course now once you guys get to here now for the high go with six foot one he's actually either six one or either six one or six foot real life i'm not too sure but around like the high now for the way go with 195 now for the wingspan guys i want you guys to max out the wingspan so yeah six foot ten it, is the um is the highest wings big guys we get so max out and if a bar ship go with any bus you guys want to i just want to find but it's up to you guys now other than that once you guys get to here you guys should get total badges of 25 25 19 and 18 and of course i'm gonna quickly go over his um like badges and then obviously like the key attribute that you guys need to um pay attention to i don't know let's get straight into it now for close shot you guys close shot is 83 so you know um that's not really too bad actually not not 83 but 82 you know that's not really too bad you guys um do get giants and now giants i would definitely suggest you guys uh, should put your giants on hall of fame just because like you know like if you're much gonna like if you much like you're on the side so you're gonna go up against like a lot of like six eight six seven six 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 nine so the giants is gonna help a lot um pro touch is another good one but that's if you guys use a layup meter um i don't suggest you know using meter at all in this game but if you guys want to use a layup meter you guys could definitely use it and then um next thing is your driving layup your driving layup is a um 88 so with 88 driving layup you guys do get pretty good animations for um it, for you guys having 88 driving layup and then of course um, you have on silly finisher you, you got acrobat you guys actually get your acrobat on gold um what else uh, you guys get um fearless finisher as well so like a lot of badges that like you know it's gonna help you guys make your layups this and that now for drive dunk now i want you guys to put your drive dunk to a 90 now with 90 drive dunk you guys get you guys will still get get your gold limitless takeoff you get um silver post shots so you guys are actually like three points away of getting um on go getting gold post riser but silver post riser is fine and then that's the end for finishing now for shooting this will get 25 now for your mid range you guys in mid range is 85 85 mid range is actually pretty high um, for this build but that's pretty good because um if you guys watch Darby Mitchell he takes a lot of like um mid -win shots you know he kind of um he like he, he kind of plays like Jalen Brownson obviously like them two not, don't have like the same playing style but like them you know it's about one thing I noticed about them too is that they take what the defense be giving them so that's what Mitchell be doing and then for and then you guys also get your green machine you get half a minimization you guys get pretty much like the good like badges that uh, uh compliment like your main riches and that now three pointer your three pointer is 88 i mean not 88 but it's 86 so with 86 three you guys um you guys will still get your uh, aging three and limited range on silver and then for buys you guys get planted some gold which that's pretty good and then um and then you guys also like get um dead eyes as well so that's much uh, enough for like uh, shooting so it wasn't really nothing too much that i need to say for shooting now for playmaking this will gets 19. now with 19 um you guys do get uh, an 80 pass accuracy 
So um, yes, we'll still get your uh, silver needle threader. You guys get gold brick starter. So you guys get your usual like um, playmaking badges for 80 pass accuracy, and you get the LeBron pass style as well. Now your ball control is 82. Not gonna lie, I was kind of disappointed when I see the ball control because Metro is definitely a, a good dribbler. He's not the best dribbler, but like he could definitely like dribble to the point where, like he could create his own shots because like. The way he plays is like he's a shot maker, so he heavily relies on like him just creating his own shots, this and that. But um, you guys do get um, silver quick first up, silver unblockable, bronze handles for days. On um, and your speed, your speed ball, of course, speed ball has to be at 75 so that you guys could get the Michael Jordan dribble style, this and that. Now nah, that's pretty much the end of playmaking. Now for defense, this build gets 18. A little bit kind of disappointed because um, I feel like this book will definitely get um, more defensive badges, at least like 22, 23 around there. Because Mitchell will be playing defense. So, but honestly, 18 is not bad at all. You know, at least he has um, defensive badges on like most replica built in the game. You know, this and that. But um, now for your premier defense, you guys end up getting 86. So you guys will also you guys will get the gold challenger and the silver clamps. And then for steel, your steel is 81. So you guys will get the silver interceptor. Now um, like that's pretty much all you need for this game. Now guys, if you guys know how to read lanes, I promise you like um, I promise you like oh, you guys don't even need that um the silver interceptor. But um, but I'm gonna say this, but if you guys are trying to make a PR lock build then I highly suggest you guys max it still and then just pretty much give yourself like the Hall of Fame badges that you need. So Hall of Fame like Interceptor, Glove, Challenger, if you're a lock, but if you're a pure lock, but if you're not a pure lock, then there's no need for you to put your steel and your, your premium defense that high. Now for speed, your speed is a, uh, 88, acceleration 90, your vertical is a uh, 80, and your stamina is a 90. Now, this build is actually pretty good. This is a, this is a really really good build. Um, I don't know what to identify as this build. To be honest, if I was to bring it to the five, the only thing I will say is that like this build could probably play like um, hash. I mean, it could play PG. The only issue is that your bar control is kind of low, so I don't know if it could play PG or like that. But I'll pretty much put them all over the two. Now I'm gonna quickly go over his uh, takeover options, and then after, yes, we'll see what I'm going to do for the um, the badges that I'll pull if I want to make this one. Now for the takeover, you guys should get slashing, shot creating, sharp and lock. I just want I just want with double slashing only just because like I'm just trying to dunk on people with this build and with Mitchell. Mitchell has some crazy like highlights of him getting crazy. Um, poster and stuff so that's why i went double finishing and you know what I'm saying and then number two like guys like who doesn't want to dunk on people right like you guys are trying to get, get yourself out like this and that but you guys could choose any takeaway you guys want to but personally i think this um slashing take uh, for both primary and secondary is definitely like the best take so i just went with that and then after you guys are done making his build you guys should get a uh, shade compressor jalen green Anthony Simons and Hawkins. You guys should get that. And as always, now this is um the um, Utah Jazz version of um, Donovan Mitchell. So um, this was what he used to play for the Jazz. This and that. So um, there is also um a Cleveland version of it. But honestly, if y'all want me to um make a, a video about it, I could definitely make it. But there's definitely the Cleveland version of it. Just comment on um, session. Um, just comment that section below and just let me know and then I'll definitely make it, um, his Cleveland version this and that. But let's go over the finishing badges real quick. Now for finishing, I want Giants to have a fame because what I said earlier, you're going to have um, like pretty much undersized and you're going to have um, guys that are taller going to be guarding this and that. So that's what I want me to have him Giants to end up coin limits take off. I put it on uh, silver pulsarizer, gold silly finisher and I put on like the rest on like finishing badges that I need so that's pretty much the end for finishing uh, if you guys are missing you guys can always go back to the video and stuff you know and see the badges that I put and now for shooting I just went with um go one shooter went with uh, half of fame amped definitely um definitely half of fame amped I mean for me I definitely half of fame amped if I was to use this build 
uh, end up coin um the blindness one agent three and limitless range now i have one um shooting badge i just went with um silver green machine and that's pretty much my end for shooting now for playmaking um for playmaking i just kept it simple so i just went with on um, silver um quick first step and silver unplockable now i end up um putting his needle threader on silver and then i did bronze handles for days so i have like nine playmaking badges to work with now i was gonna put killer combos but i know i'm just gonna put killer combos you know killer combos doesn't really work like that i mean for next gen it doesn't really work but i'm, I'm not too sure about current gen but i know for next gen it doesn't work and then i put on Bella. now finally for defense this build gets 18 so i just went with my workouts on silver i did on um, pick dodge on gold i mean like it depends on the game that i'm playing like if i'm playing like more of like 5v5 like especially like pro and stuff then I'll definitely put a pick dodger because a lot of like teams be running um the uh, pick and roll with a guard. So if I'm guarding ball, I definitely need a pick dodger. But I end up on coin on um, the challenger and I put it on um, the clamps. So I get um silver clamps. And then at this point, I have like two finishing badges. So I went out about pass and I decided to go with um pick dodger. Actually, not, not pick dodge but workhorse. So this is pretty much my end for finishing, shooting, playmaking, and defense. And guys, I'm gonna wrap up the video right here. Um, comment down below how y'all feel about this W mission build. Y'all think this build is really good. But I think that is show by Josh Shot 23. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I don't know. I'm a